of the work we do here at the medical city. I remember my mother when I was a little boy and I was out playing in the yard. I come from a family of 13. Seven boys and six girls. I'm the only boy there. I was number four. I was the youngest at that time. The nine had not yet come, so I was the youngest boy. And I always found myself when not playing in the kitchen, seated and enjoying the aroma of the food that my mother was cooking. My mother at that time had no maids. She was the cook, the laundry woman, the house cleaner. <clears throat> and I always kept that company. And I remember smelling the aroma of the adobo that she would cook, followed with uh, this yellow flower. Anyway, adobo with a lot of potatoes. I didn't realize the value of potatoes then. But for you health conscious people, stop eating white rice. That's very rich in carbohydrate and if you want to avoid heart disease, diabetes, and all the complications, cut down. It will also reduce the fat where it is deposited right here. If I have lost some of it, it's because stuff. And I found potatoes the better substitute. Why? Potatoes are 70% water. So how can you get stuff with water? Well, anyway. I like to telling patients things like that. Not only the problem that they had or discuss that, but it's always nice to talk and talk about things that they, you think they will not be interested. I've been asked a lot of times about Alzheimer's. So I have to know something about Alzheimer's because I know I don't want to have Alzheimer's. Who does? It is often said that big potatoes are on top of the heap because there are always small potatoes underneath pushing you up. Well, I have never deluded myself into thinking that I am a big potato. Hell no. But I have had a number of you here and hopefully some more standing up. Have holding me up, meaning you are the supposedly small place, so that my work looks even better. 